this is a milk software management dashboard screen where we can see all the statistic data of total farmers total customer total collection boy next we can see all the statistic data of today's total sale amount total paid amount total due amount total milk collected and total milk sale next is showing all total sale amount paid amount and due amount moving forward this is a master list where we can see expense category bank manage shift manage sell rate manage rate chart configuration items and product converter first is expense category here we can see category name category status edit and delete option and from here we can add category next is bank manage here we can add bank name against farmer name ifsc code account number here is edit and delete option and from this we can add bank against farmer name next is shift manage here we can add shift name start time of the shift and end time of the shift this is edit and delete option and from here we can add shift this is shift name after the shift start time and shift end time then submit after the sell rate manage here type per liter and then sell rate this is edit and delete option and here it is add sell rate here we can enter type quantity per liter and then sell rate after that clicking on submit after that rate chart configuration here shift milk type is there clicking on rate chart here is the option of select rate chart we can choose file from here after the shift milk type and then click on submit after that item here we can enter item name and item rate this is edit and delete option and from here we can add item after that product converter here we can choose item date milk quantity to make that item and quantity made from that after that clicking on submit we listed that product on the list after that branch manage here we can add branch branch name branch contact number branch address and then submit this is a view branch we can see all the branch name with branch mobile number and branch address here is edit and delete option from here also we can add branch next is employee manage here is add employee here we can add employee name employee email employee contact number and employee address with password after that view employee here we can see employee code with employee name mobile number address email and also edit and delete option from here also we can add employee after that collection boy manage here we can enter collection boy name boy email contact number and address and password 
सेम एज इम्प्लॉय मैनेज हियर इज व्यू कलेक्शन बॉय ऑल द लिस्ट ऑल द लिस्ट इज शोइंग ओवर हेयर ऑफ द कलेक्शन बॉय नेक्स्ट इज फार्मर मैनेज हेयर वी कैन एड फार्मर विथ नेम ई मेल कॉन्टैक्ट नंबर एड्रेस एंड आधार नंबर देन सबमिट आफ्टर दैट व्यू फार्मर हेयर वी कैन सी ऑल द फार्मर नेम विथ मोबाइल नंबर एड्रेस आधार नंबर एंड ई मेल नंबर एंड एडिट डिलीट एंड व्यू ऑप्शन फ्रॉम बैक Here is customer manage. Here we can add customer by entering customer name, email, contact number, address, and password. After that, clicking on submit, we listed on the view customer. Here we can see customer name with mobile number, address, email with edit and delete option. From here also we can add customer. After that milk collection. From here we can enter user code. By entering user code, all the details on the field will enter automatically. And we can also enter manually. By filling all the field, the milk collection details are added on the list. After that, clicking on submit, we can view collection from here. All all the list are showing over here. This is farmer name, user, date, shift, quantity, fat, CNF, per liter price, due amount. From here we can update all the collection details. This is the list of milk collection. After that cell. From add cell we can use code of that particular customer or we can enter details manually. By filling all the field, clicking on submit, we listed on the cell list. This is a view cell where we can see customer, date, cell type, shift, price, discount, total, paid and due. And edit view and delete option is there. And from here also we can add cell. After that stock, by clicking on stock, we will see the quantity of the item. After that payment, this is a customer payment. Where we can see customer code, name, mobile number, quantity, amount, paid amount and due amount. By clicking on collect and then clicking on invoice will show the remaining amount due according to that customer pay and filling all the details in the paid amount field after that farmer payment back and then from payment option this is a farmer payment this is a due amount and this is a pay option this is invoice number and we can see 5.02 is remaining
so after paying this list will show this is a expense list here we can add expense this is category date party name amount and comment after that view expense here all the list of expense will show over here this is category name date party name amount and comment edit and delete option and from here also we can add expense after that report here we can see report of milk collection milk sale and product sale report after that settings clicking on settings we can set the name contact number and address and update the information after that clicking on dashboard will reflect all the statistics of today's data after completing the flow of admin now we are going forward with the collection boy this is the collection boy dashboard where we can see all the statistics data of the collection boy now going to sales option where we can find add sale and view sale clicking on add sale we can use code or mobile number to fetch the data automatically on the field or we can manually put the data on the field clicking on submit we listed it on the view sale option this is the sell list from where we can edit view and delete and also add sell from this add sell screen after that mill collection this has two option add collection and view collection going to add collection we can use code to fetch the data automatically on the field or we can manually put the data on the field clicking on submit we listed it on the view collection this is the milk collection list where we can see all the details related to the particular collection we can edit and delete the collection and also add milk collection from this option now going to report it has milk collection report milk sale report and product sale report going to milk collection report we can view report of the particular period by entering all the data on the field and click on search will show the report of the particular farmer milk collection report same will be applicable to milk sale report and product sale report. So this is the basic flow of the collection 